Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to Morals in Minutes. Within the previous century, many previously non-Muslims had converted into the religion due to Islam's stance on racial equality, particularly in countries such as the United States and Canada. Such people had at one point felt disillusioned, disappointed and let down by the internal failures of the self-destructing mechanisms within other religions which failed to equip them when dealing with the issue of racial equality. Likewise, we find that many women had entered into the religion through feeling that Islam had come to emancipate women in a way which other religions had not. Therefore, foundationally, it is rational that Islam abhors the disease of prejudice and partisanship, particularly the kind of partisanship which causes pride in something which is entirely accidental, such as race, nationality or gender. To this effect, Imam Sadiq has narrated the Prophet, peace be upon him, said, Whosoever possesses in his heart asabiyya, prejudice in any of its forms, such as tribalism, racism or nationalism, even to the extent of a mustard seed, God will raise him on the day of resurrection with the pagan Bedouins of the Jahiliyyah, the pre-Islamic era. That's the end of today's moral. See you next time. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.